Well, hello folks, welcome along to the channel. I am the Custom Profit. We're back here for our Tennis Manager 24 playthrough. We're following Taps McGeegan and he is starting to purr, which is great news. He has got himself a victory and we're right at the end of the clay season. He's at another semi-final trying to get another win himself. So we'll see how that goes and then we'll move on into grass. So you can see here, this is how Taps is getting on in his mentals that you've got here. So anticipation, focus, tactical skills. These are all almost into double figures, which is great. Uh, really working hard on those. The other things that we've got that we're sort of improving on uh, are things around his serve. I think getting a good serve up and running quickly is going to be critical. You can see his ranking has rocketed from where we were last time. He's now 316th in the world. And this will be going up, I think, into the top three. 300 at the end of the tournament today so let's have a look how he's got on in the last few matches you saw him in nottingham where he got through to the semi-final unfortunately lost in that match he went straight out then to serbia to play in nice got through to another semi-final this time lost to the zimbabwean ruda j who he had played and beaten earlier on Jay got himself a tournament victory, so good on him. So, uh, Krusty getting doing well, but just not quite enough. In the next tournament, a couple of weeks later, he was in Managua in Nicaragua. I had no idea where that was. And you can see he got a really good run through to the finals here, um, beating the likes of Marcus Antonius, which wasn't too hard. Washington, I've got a really long name. Um, next up, but the real impressive one was Olives Joe, <laughs> which is the best name, Olives Joe. <laughs> oh, I hope that person's real. <laughs> oh, dear me. Anyway, you beat him 7 5 7 5. Won 6 3 7 4 in the uh, semis against Alexander uh, Kusai, who's 503rd. And eventually beat Filippo Alfano um, in the final. So really, really impressive. Uh, cross, uh, Taps getting himself a second tournament victory of his career. So looking at how Taps is getting on currently in the current tournament, he has uh, he's seeded, which is great. Uh, uh, so he beat this uh, Vietnamese player, uh, Su Chi Nicholas Cheng, uh, 388th in the world, 6'4", six, 6'love. Um, uh, Snir Morag from Israel uh, beat him 6-1-6-4 really wasn't too difficult um, first real challenge he had was against Ali Misoum of uh, Morocco uh, beat him 7-5-6-1 uh, to get into the semi-finals and he's going to be playing uh, Turkish player Aaron uh, Baybars uh, who's 396th in this semi-final. If he gets through that, there is no seeds left. He will be playing Nicolas Biena of Peru. So it's going to be a fun one. Fingers crossed, Krusty can get all the way there. Let's dive in and watch. Never played this uh, opposition before. He's in excellent form. Uh, top spin baseliner and he is... Backhand is where he's strong, but in, in all honesty, I don't think there's too much of an issue. You can see here, we've, I think, got a pretty good uh, approach, and then we're going to be using that um, in our current tournament. So he is currently indecisive, so we want to motivate him. If you dominate the first few games, he will not see the light of day. Well, that did not work. I really need to get my finger out with that. I've got all the information to actually do a uh, a video around um, maintaining the mental state. I've got all of the like a whole. Um, that's a lovely bit of play there. A whole spreadsheet uh, on that. So uh, he gets the first point here. Let's see how he gets on. Well, it's interesting. Babers has got a fifteen forty lead in on uh, Taps' serve. Doesn't go in there. That's a lovely hit in right into the corner. Taps this wall to get out of that. First opportunity, and it's a lovely shot down the middle there. Oh, into the net with the serve. So he has been broken, but straight away, 15-40 on the Turks serve. And that's a lovely return. Really puts the pressure on. 
and uh, I think that's a really well played point. It was, uh, um, and he's got the break back. Well, interestingly, it's it's a tight old set this one. It's uh, 30, 40, and there we go. It's 5-3, and Taps could be losing this. It, well, he could be, but he has, he's got another break at 5-3, 15-40. Oh, I thought he'd got that cross court. And he hit that one well, but just not high enough. Come on, Taps. That's well done. So he saved those two break points. But Taps has got another one. He wants this. He's coming into the net. Oh, he's a lovely little um, volley there. You he he can understand why he was celebrating. And he has got... He saved three break points and now he has a set point. That's a lovely hit. Oh, and it comes over. He's got away with a bit of luck. 6-3. But Taps gave him a good run for his money. I don't think we need to change anything. I think he's he's doing pretty well. Well, one love in the second set. 30-40. So Taps has got the first break opportunity. Just about gets that one back. And a nice little backhand volley there to uh, take the, uh, the break away from Taps. <laughs> second opportunity here. Taps working hard on, on Baybars. And he's got the break. Two love. 5-3, uh, 40-15 up. Looks like Taps is going to take set number two here. Should Surely should do that. There we go. Very, very nicely done. And uh, more of the same, please, in set number three. We're not going to change anything. We're just going to get out there. And he has got a break opportunity straight away. 30-40. Just doesn't get it over the net. That return is something we need to work on. Another advantage here, but he's he's hit a lot of these ones into the net where he struggles to get his his feet right. Ooh, that was good though. That was good. Not quite in in the last one, but another opportunity to take an early lead. And it's a double fault in the end, and Taps does get the break. Maybe a break back. It's 30-40 though. It's a nice uh, shot there. Oh, well, well done. It is one all. Double break. Another break opportunity in the very next game. It's 2-1. Come on. That's nicely done. Oh, it's a dreadful volley and Taps has got the break. And he's 2-1 up now. <laughs> what is going on? I think we're going to have to just change something on his serve because... His serve is just not working. Just go a little bit more aggressive, I think. Here we go. It's uh, He's love 40 down. It looks like he's going to be taken back to 2-2. Uh, uh, Interesting. Taps has not had too much trouble up to now, but... You know he's doing, he's doing, he's done well. He hasn't, he hasn't really had to, to fight so hard in any of the games. That's a cracker of a performance, and he's just—is he going to get back? Oh wow! Well, he, he worked really hard to get back into that one. 30-40. That's a nice return using the width here. Oh, wow. Off the top of the racket. Last possible time. It's 2 all. Well, Taps was 40-30 uh, up. But, um, well, back to Juice. Looks like we might be going to a tie break if Taps can get through this one. And that's exactly what's happening. Which way is this going to go? In all honesty, Baybars has been a little bit better this set. So I'm slightly concerned Taps will not have the, uh, the wherewithal to, to make this happen. Look at this. Really pressuring him. Oh, he wins the point. And Taps looks like he might have got through this. 6-2 on the tie break. Oh, 
Oh, that's a beautiful shot down the line. That's exactly what I want him to do. And yeah, someone in the comments mentioned he looked like Hulk Hogan a little bit. <laughs> a young Hulk Hogan who's been in the sun for far too long. I mean, the Hulkster was pretty, he was pretty orange, wasn't he? But um, yeah, he's missing the hair. Right, and well, that's really good. I think that's excellent. We are through into another final. Trying to um, reduce his confidence just a little bit. I don't want him to get presumptuous. And this is the financial report. So we ask, look how much money we are get, having to spend on, you know, on 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 just the infrastructure. We can't afford this. We cannot afford this. We are three hundred thousand pounds in debt. We desperately need some money from the board. Otherwise, we are going to be in deep, deep trouble. Right here we go. We've got Nicola, Nicholas Biena, who's four hundred ninety fifth. You, th you feel we might have this today. Uh, he's demotivated. I believe in you. And without reaction, I think that was the motivation one. But we didn't get anything there. Right, come on, taps. Let's do it. Well, pretty even start, but it's 30, 40 to taps. So it looks like he might be, uh, well, he gets the first opportunity, but a lovely hit there. Back to Juice. I feel this is going to be a nice battle between two pretty good players, even with the slightly higher ranking of this player. You know, to get to this level of the tournament, you've got to think that he's, he, he, He's pretty good. There's very little, I think, between many of these players. Um, so hopefully we have a, a good old scrap here. An advantage. Come on. Looks like Taps is, is putting the pressure on anyway. That's a lovely hit there. <laughs> Equally lovely return. Again, trying to go wide there. And he's gone way long with that. Played right into Taps' hand. It's 3 2. He's got the break. And Taps is 5 4 up in set number one. 40 15 up. Looks like he might have this. Gotta be, hasn't it? Oh, he's gone long. What a disastrous shot that was. Maybe this time. Oh, maybe. He's gone half with that wow two easy chances and taps just gives it them what about this one there we go down the line that's what he should have done the first time he's got an advantage putting the pressure on here into the net there we go six four well done taps more of the same in set number two don't need to change anything and with that in mind, Taps has got himself an advantage in set number two. Can't make the most of it. One all, and uh, Taps has battled hard in this game to get an advantage. Lots and lots of juices. Didn't let the game get away from him, and he's got a chance here. So if he takes this, it is through grit and determination. Got to get. You've got to make the most of the chances when they arrive into the net and that's exactly what he's done 2-1 he's got the break and taps was completely dominant winning every game 40 love on his serve until he gets this important one it's gone long though he packed a juice and he has got himself a, a match point a championship point Let's see what uh, what he can come up with here he's gone long 6-4 6-4 taps has got another win his final match in the clay season he'll be going on to grass soon uh, but obviously very very happy with this um let's see what that does to his his position he is in the top 300 now remember what we need to do by the end of season one is get him in the top 200 we look well on course to do to doing that um yeah so really really happy with how it's going from a a tennis point of view I'm just very very concerned how it's going from a financial point of view because what I do not want to happen is they basically kick us out because we can't control the finances even though there's nothing we can do we can't we can't just not use one of the facilities because that's not an option in the game so you are absolutely screwed if that's the case because there's no way out of it
you're basically in an impossible position if they will not give you money. But we will see. We will see. If that happens, well, we'll, we'll do something. I'm not sure entirely how we'll play it if that does happen. Let me know in the comments if you've had that happen. That's probably a useful thing to know. Anyway, folks, Tabs is heading up the rankings into the top 300. He's won another tournament. That is three tournaments, but they're all at the 30 level. Hopefully, we can get him into the 60 level tournaments and winning in those. And he's got a few of those on the grass courts coming up. Right, if you did enjoy that, please hit that like button, subscribe if you're new. I'll see you for the next one. Goodbye.